everyone and welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be my most requested video of all time. On my Instagram, I posted a poll on my story asking which video I should film today and you guys chose. Obviously, I knew how to whiten your teeth. Before I get into this video, don't forget to subscribe. I really want to hit 500 subscribers by the end of the month and I think it's totally possible, so let's do it. Now, what everybody's been asking me, the whitener that I use is called Plus White. And what's just crazy about it is that it is $5. And what's crazier about it is that it's only available at Walmart. I mean, personally, I've seen it at CVS, but it's literally three times the price. So, no. I swear to you, and I promise when I say that this product will change your life. Not sponsored, but hashtag should be. Growing up, I would say I had a pretty conservative little Christian family. They never let me wear like trendy clothes, like the Hollister and like the Abercrombie type clothes. The Tory's Secret was like, no. And I wasn't allowed to wear makeup, which was really hard for me until like later years um, to school. Um, so it was kind of hard for me, but I wanted to find something that would make me stand out. Not stand out, but something else you could recognize about me. So when I was like 14, like freshman in high school, I was like, what if I whiten my teeth? But then again, I'm 14, so I don't have a job. <laughs> so how am I gonna pay for this? So then I scrolled through like YouTube and I was looking at all of those like DIY stuff with like, I think it was like lemon acid or what is it, like banana peels. And I was like, not gonna do that. And then I stumbled upon like all the other videos that were like the Crest White Strips or Dial a Smile, I think it was, that was really popular. But I mean, those things, like low key, I feel like they don't work. And they're like 60 to 100 bucks like every month. So that's nothing that I can really do. Then again, I'm not gonna ask my parents for money for this. So then I finally found Katie Johnson's video. If you don't know her, she is an OG YouTube makeup guru. She's awesome and she's so fabulous. She swore by this video and tutorial. She did a demo of using this product and what got me to do it was it wasn't sponsored. So I knew that it was true. And she swore by this that she used it in high school for herself. And that's the only thing that she's used her entire life. And so I went out to the store, I got the supplies and you guys like, it works obviously. Like it's so crazy. Now, my teeth are very white and this product is very strong sometimes I, I don't want to say like I feel insecure but I feel paranoid just because like my teeth are so white like when I want to post like certain photos like I'll insert some photos like up here like my teeth are so white in person and they're so white like when I take photos as well and like with my friends that like don't whiten their teeth like it looks shady on my part like I've had every question up and down the yin yang asked from my friends. Did you use Facetune to whiten your teeth? Are my teeth fake? Do you wear veneers? Are they porcelain? No, like, I don't know. So it makes me feel kind of weird or like anxious when I like post photos. But like, honestly, I love my smile and that's all that matters. Regardless, I love my smile and I wanna do what I can to help you love yours too. Right now, I'm going to tell you guys all the materials that you need to do the whitening process and doing a step-by-step -step demo on how to put all the things together. The materials that you're gonna need include a toothbrush, toothpaste, floss, the plus white whitener gel, Q-tips, a clear mouth guard, lastly, act mouthwash. Step one is to brush and floss your teeth very well, very thorough. 
brush up and down, side to side, zigzag, reverse, circle, everything, you guys. You want to make sure that your teeth are completely smooth and anything. And you want to make sure that you floss super well. If you don't floss before you whiten, it's going to be very noticeable because if you have food in between your teeth, then it's not obviously going to whiten the insides of your teeth, if that makes sense. So it, your in-betweens will be yellow. So you don't really want that. So make sure that you brush and floss your teeth very well. Step two is to boil water and put your clear mouth guard in. You can get this clear mouth guard from Walmart as well. It's gonna be located in, I believe, the sports aisle next to those like sweatband thingies, like the basketball players wear on their wrists and their heads. It's gonna be there. It should be 97 cents. And then what you're gonna do is after you boil water in the kettle, you're gonna drop the mouth guard into the boiling water and leave it in there for about 10 seconds and then pull it out with a spoon. The mouth guard is gonna be very flimsy and very hot. What you're gonna wanna do is take the mouth guard, put it in your mouth and smooth it so that it completely covers your teeth so that it's a complete mold. You can see what it's supposed to look like when you do it right. Um, it's completely molded to my entire mouth. Step three is gonna be finally to apply the gel. Option one is if your teeth are pretty white like mine, you're just gonna take the bottle as it is and then you're just gonna squeeze it a little bit and then just put it on your teeth right on the spot like that. And then all you're gonna do is put your mouth guard in and leave it in for five to 10 minutes. If this is your first time or your teeth are pretty stained, what you're gonna wanna do is take the gel and a Q-tip, put some gel on the Q-tip and like, I don't wanna say massage, but like massage it into your teeth, not into your gums, but into the teeth, in between the teeth, and then put some extra on there and then put a little bit in the mouth guard and leave it in for 15 to 20 minutes. Step four is to take the mouth guard out and rinse your mouth with cold water. Not warm water, cold water. Finally, the last step, step five, is going to be to rinse your mouth with some Act mouthwash. You're gonna need this to protect your teeth um, after you've bleached, damaged, destroyed your teeth with this whitener. Just kidding, it's not that bad. Make sure you do this to keep your teeth in your best interest. After you finish doing the mouthwash, you can't eat or drink for 30 minutes because you need to let the act do its thing, act on your teeth, I guess. So just don't do any eating or drinking, not even water for 30 minutes. But after that, you can eat or drink whatever you want. Again, if you have pretty white teeth like myself, then all you need to do is do this once a week, maybe twice a week tops, but I'm being honest 100%, I haven't whitened my own teeth since freshman year of high school, which was six years ago. If you have stained teeth or it is your first time doing it, then you need to do it twice a day, 14 days in a row, and then after that, once a week. I promise that it will work if you follow the steps that I gave you. The last thing I'm gonna say in this video is keep up and maintenance. The way that your teeth look after you do this process has a lot to do with your diet. I am the worst about this. Um, I love candy, I love dots, I love Red Bull, I love Gatorade, I love pop, I love coffee. I drink coffee every single day. The reason why my teeth still maintain white is because even though I like eat that stuff, like I brush my teeth right away within a good amount of time, and instead of drinking normally with like a mug, where like let's say like if I took a sip of coffee, it would touch all my teeth. I know this sounds weird, but I do drink my hot coffee through a straw, like in a Starbucks tumbler. Um, I know a lot of you are gonna hate that, but I mean, it's better than it touching your teeth. Same for Red Bull. I'm sure that stuff eats up your teeth like no other. So I literally always drink everything through a straw. That is everything. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're still watching, I want you to comment Red Bull in the comment section because that's literally what I've been drinking, Red Bull and Gatorade right now mixed together. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Focus. On me. Focus. Okay. Hi everyone. <laughs> hi every. Hi every. Hi everyone and welcome. <laughs>